Okay guys, I'm going to show you a, uh, a different way of wrapping. So instead of the standard wrap just covering the knuckles, this time I'm going to show you how to go through your fingers. So the start is pretty much the same as the, the standard wrap. So we're going to come over, go through it again in case you haven't seen the standard wrap. We're going to go around your wrist three or four times, again depending on how long your wraps are. After I've gone around the fourth, the fourth time, I'm then going to bring the wrap underneath my, underneath my form and then over the top. So then you loop it through and lock round like that. So then your thumb's locked in. Go around the wrist again one more time. And then from there, so you're going to spread your fingers out nice and wide so you can get the wrap through. Then I come from back underneath my, my wrist from the thumb side. And then you're going to come up and then over and then through where your fingers go, yeah? So you want to move from right to left on your right hand. Say so opposite on your on your left hand. And then through, like that. You see now I've gone all through my fingers. So you're gonna bring it back round then, underneath your hand. And then you wanna come back up to the top, back to the uh, the top knuckle. And then you wanna go around the knuckles then. That's it, spread the fingers out, like that. <clears throat> Three or four times again. Then I've done done that there like that. I'll come back round to my wrist, round my wrist again, back round my thumb, and then whatever I've got left, I am then going to wrap around to keep my wrist nice and protected. Yeah. So from there now, you can see look, they go through my fingers. I've got a nice tighter wrap there like that. So it just depends on what you prefer. Uh, some people prefer to go through the fingers. Some people prefer to have it as a, as a standard wrap. So give them both a go, guys. You might find one easier than the other. And uh, any questions, uh, then let me know.